going back to the basics. First meal of the day on Sunday and it's almost 1.30. We went to go see the show home. So we just got back. We're having some eggs, a couple of fried eggs, turkey bacon, some guacamole, and a couple of slices of tomato. And that'll be breakfast. Breakfast is done. Now we're out going for a walk. Nice sunny day. Had a blowout with my boots. I think I might have to get a new pair or just Head back to runners until next year. So back from our walk, it's around four o'clock. We're gonna have some more of these vegetable chicken steamed dumplings. Some of this Thai uh, kitchen sauce. It's like a peanut sauce. It goes great with the dumplings. I added a little bit of soy uh, mixture and I added some of these sesame seeds on top with a little bit more flavor. Papa's probably going to want some sriracha, but I'll let him do that. And then I made some mixed uh, peppers, onions, and mushrooms. Going to have a little bit of that for a side. And that will be supper. So, Sunday night dessert. I got a little craving for something sweet. So, I got a little bit of this. Of the American Dream Nut Butter. It is delicious. And I put a little bit of water with that. Mix it up and put some strawberries on top. It's so good. All right, so I made some blueberry protein oats. I got a few here. I used the 1UP Nutrition Unicorn Donut that I got from Buff Bunny. And that was a long time ago. I still have quite a bit left because I just opened it. So we'll be using up that. And it is delicious. They got some blueberries in there, some protein in there, and of course some oatmeal and a little bit of milk. So breakfast this morning is some of the protein oats, the blueberry protein oats that I made, a whole bunch of them for the week, and they're ready to go in the fridge. So for lunch today, we're going to have one of these Stouffer's Bistro Meatballs Mozzarella, and one serving, there's two portions in there, one serving is 310 calories, and 10 grams of protein. I just finished my bracelet. I drive Nana crazy. How, how, how badly do you drive me crazy? You drive, you drive me to drink? Coffee. There you go.
All right, so that was a class. I believe that one was the burn. And I'll show a picture of the three choices. But this week, I get to do all three. Today is Tuesday, and I go, I come back on Thursday, and I come back on Saturday. So I got to videotape a little bit, thanks to Lindsay. Thank you, Lindsay, she's the coach. Uh, she trains here as well as, uh, there's a couple other coaches that train here. The only one I know is Lindsay, so. And she also teaches the classes. I'm a hot mess right now because I usually go in the bathroom and blow dry my hair so I don't go outside with wet hair. But both bathrooms were full and occupied. So I'm gonna go home and have a shower. And then I'm gonna have my cauliflower pizza for supper. So this is what my cauliflower pizza looks like. I'm gonna eat this on the way home. If I'm still hungry, I'm gonna have myself some nut butter for my dessert. So I finished my pizza and here is my dessert. An apple with some of this American Dream nut butter, the cashew butter, the twisted treat. This one is by far my favorite. It's that caramel right there. And of course, I'm gonna have a banana. Okay, Harper, what is that page? Um, it's the ending of my book. Yay. Oh my god. <laughs> and so you only have the last stickers, the very last stickers to put on. Yeah. So get the stickers and, we'll and, put, put, it on and put them on. Let's do it. And put it on the good job. Yes. Okay. Well, this was truly painful. No, it wasn't. Oh, for Nana, it was painful. <laughs> That's why you make me what? What do I drink? Coffee. That's right. You guys make me drink regular coffee. Okay, so now we have to write our name, right? Write your name. Perfect. Yay! Thank the Lord. Finding having breakfast. Got the kids to school. I'm having a coffee and a carrot muffin from Robin's Donuts. Excited. It's like Christmas. Got my Amazon box. And guess what? I got to travel with. Woohoo! A new Kindle. No more books on the road. We have to lighten up the camper. So Wednesday supper is homemade stew. It's got everything in there. Vegetables galore. And I'm going to have a nice big salad to start. Dessert tonight is some strawberries. And the last of my twisted treat. American dream nut butter. Cheers. This was my favorite. Good morning Thursday breakfast. And I realize now that every video will have some kind of cartoon in the background. So I'll just keep talking so I don't get something happen to my videos because of it. I don't know if that works that way. I think it's just music. Not sure. Anyway, this is the greens drink that I have every morning now with some apple cider vinegar. And this morning I'm having two slices of Ezekiel bread, some avocado or guac instead of bacon. Um, it, I just wanted to do a little bit of a change. I got two poached eggs with some everything but the bagel seasoning. And that is breakfast. Yummy. So this is lunch. We're having Philly Cheesesteak Bistro Cuisine as a Stouffer's. It's 310 calories and 9 grams of protein. Something quick, something fast. The kids got Donald's today because they were good all week. Harper had finished her book and Graceland had put herself in her chair in the van all week. So we got treats and this is mine. Well, it's Thursday and we're back at the gym. Another class workout. Last one was burn. This one, I think, I'm not sure which one it is. Let's go check it out. We're early today. I got off earlier, so I asked in, instead of going at five, I'm going at 4.30. But I'm actually really early. I'm only, I'm here at 3.30. So if we can go in even earlier, at 4 maybe, we'll see. So I'm not sure which one. But we did that one on Tuesday. Uh oh, here she comes. Gotta run.
So that was the build. That one right there. Killer. <laughs> All right, 200 grams of chicken breast with some sauce. I made a uh, chicken pot pie at the kid's house. So I just brought the, the gravy mix part with the carrots and the peas. I also made a broccoli, cauliflower, carrot, uh, like a pasta salad without the pasta and this is 200 grams of chicken breast and that is supper good morning uh, it is saturday morning a lot of running around to do today i grabbed myself a coffee and a bacon and egger from mcdonald's and now at lunchtime i'm having one of these stouffer bistro little sandwiches this is the one with the sausage the like 270 some calories and I found a place in town that sells the built bars so I don't have to order them online anymore yay no more shipping fees it's it's awesome so I got myself a mixed box today and the total cost was 62 which is way cheaper believe it or not than what I paid before to get it shipped here so I'm happy about that. So I got some more running around to do today. I'm gonna finish my little sandwich and then it's a no workout day today because I work out tomorrow, which is Saturday at the gym for 11 o'clock class. Oh, here we go. Friday night supper, an easy supper because it's usually pizza night and we're trying to save some money. This is what Papa's having. He's having the meatball marinara, which has 20 grams of protein. And I am having the grilled chicken broccoli Alfredo, which is 28 grams of protein. And that'll be supper. Mm -mm -mm. Snack tonight is a crispy mini caramel chocolate chip rice crisps and peanut butter cheesecake nut butter. Good morning Saturday. Today that means breakfast. We got some eggs, some turkey bacon, tomatoes, and we're going live on tumbleweed. So it's Saturday and it was the burn class. I'm a sweaty mess. I'm gonna go home have a shower. First I'm gonna hit the treadmill, do 20 minutes at least, get my steps in, and then I'm headed home. It's the end of the week. I got everything ready for our new renter. The house is ready, beds are made. I have to get the other bed to my son's house. We're gonna give a bed away because we only need one bed for this renter. It's only gonna be one guy this time. So that's a bonus because the kids could use the bed. We can get rid of some furniture. So the week was a tough one. Everybody was tired. Kids are going through a transition right now. We're getting uh, them into a new daycare. Um, so I'm hoping that it works out, that they get adjusted to the times. Poor kids, they just, it's really early. It's really tough, you know, for kids to be, <laughs> for kids to be up at five o'clock in the morning, or I guess it's gonna be 5.45, but still, anyway. I'm just hoping and praying that they get adjusted. And it'll be me just taking care of Wyatt for a little while. And so we can do more stuff with the boy. I'm wearing this because I had to go out into the truck camper. The Eagle Cap is cleaned. Not totally cleaned, but at least the fridge and the microwave are cleaned. I had to do a thorough cleaning of the fridge because unfortunately the freezer door got shut and I have to bleach it all out so that was done i wore my mask made sure that i was protected and i didn't breathe in any bad stuff so everything's good but yeah the truck camper is ready to rock and roll for september gonna be heading out into the wild yonder into uh the states for a little bit then up back into canada we have a meetup in uh, michigan and i'm pretty i'm pretty excited about it it's called m22 we missed the one last year the m21 so i'm pretty excited to go to this one so had a good week uh i didn't hit the gym as much as i wanted to i have bad news i actually hurt myself on a monday after the saturday last i did three three workouts so the monday after the saturday workout it was 
a lot of arms, a lot of shoulders, and I overdid it with the, I, mean, I, can't, I can't do it because this is my arm that's sore, but I lifted a kettlebell too high for some of the workout and I didn't feel it right away, but I sure felt it the next day. And then it got worse on Monday and I was like, oh boy, this is going to put a big damper on my rest of the week. And it did. So basically I did not get to go to the gym as much as I wanted to. And I did not do any uh, trainings, group trainings all week because of this shoulder. So... I'm hoping that with rest, and I'm resting it, I'm resting it today, I rested it yesterday, uh, that it gets better and that I can do some more group training because I do have six months free group training and I'm gonna try to take advantage of it, but if you're hurt, you're hurt, right? Anyway, so that being said, I am hoping to get at least my steps in I was working like crazy today and like I said this is done everything's done ready for the renter and I'm just gonna rest for the rest of the weekend and hopefully I can be better by Tuesday because Tuesday is my next gym session and I'm I'm wanting to hit that Tuesday and Thursday at least and hit the gym on Monday Wednesday and Friday just for uh, different body parts uh, mostly legs and get my walking my steps in I'm hoping by the end of this month to show progress pictures and to update everybody on how it's going that way I have not weighed myself because I refuse to <laughs> I have not uh, I have not wanted to I I don't feel any change yet so I don't want to discourage myself and wait that is um that is a sticky subject with me uh weighing myself so i'm not doing that i don't want to uh discourage myself and i will see you next friday next week next vlog you take care enjoy your weekend or if this is another day enjoy your day get out there get moving and just go for a walk in nature because that's what i'm going to be doing today Let's do it. Bye, everybody.